MTV, welcome to my crib. <sighs> Too much, I don't even work out. Okay, come on in my friends. <sighs> I'm gonna need a minute. <laughs> Ugh. Yep, my upper lip is sweating. Okay, good. Okay, y'all, welcome to the show. This is where the K-Crab lives. I can't even say that, seriously. I don't even know that crabs live in shells. <laughs> like, truly, actually, what do crabs live in? I don't know. Somebody text me or DM me, actually, because y'all don't have a number. But anyways, this is where the crab was born. Not physically, obviously. This is where the K-Crab, the Instagram, that's where this was started, right here. Y'all are witnessing it. Come on in. Okay, y'all, this is where the magic happens. So many things go down in this bed. For example, cuddling, sleeping, working, dance parties, pillow fights with my cats, nighttime stories with my cats, movies, Netflix. This is where it goes down. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, we're cuddling. Ooh, yeah, yeah. We're <laughs> This is actually my office. I just prop myself up in here and I do -do 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 -do, get to work, edit things, hang out with y'all. So moving right along, things that happen over here are real typical. Laying here, drinking my kombucha. <coughs> uh, <coughs> enough of that. Let's move it right along. Okay, welcome, come. Hey y'all, here is the crab's K. Nope, the K crab's crab. <laughs> the K crab's lair, the K crab's home, the K crab's shell. This is where we are. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, this right here is my calendar where I record all my workouts. As you can see, February went really well and March has gone about the same. Thumbs up for that. So if you're coming over here, you're looking at, this is my bed right here. There's Ray. She's having her afternoon nap. Um, I have an obsession with pillows and I'm not entirely sure why. Here's Ray. Say hi, Ray. How's your day so far? That good, huh? Let's go over here. We got my little nightstand, okay? This is my book of poems that I read to my cats. I could pee on this. I have some sort of obsession with collecting journals that I basically never use. Hey girl, how's it going? How's your nap going? Any big plans for the weekend? Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh, yeah, me too. Right, right, right. Definitely looking forward to it. Got some windows, a whole lot of nothing happening over there. That's where their toys are. Well, at least some of them. We got toys everywhere, but there's some toys. So this is an overview of my vanity. We got a few little random knickknacks. These drawers are Alex drawers. I got the black brown ones from Ikea. And then I got this tabletop that's just screwed in on either side so that it doesn't come off. Ooh, ooh, what do we got? Yeah, yeah, what do we got? Right here, we've got this spinning lipstick tower. I got this from Julia's place like four or five years ago something like that I don't think they sell it anymore but obviously I got it because bling this holds a lot of my MAC lipsticks there's some makeup geek lipsticks up there we got some of my favorite perfumes because a girl is single and ready to mingle so you know I gotta be smelling good we got some Dolce and Gabbana Fendi and Madonna some uh, Marc Jacobs dot speaking of which I'm about to be on mine and I just want chocolate these two little shelves don't know where they're from someone gave them to me I got both of the acrylic lipstick holders from Amazon I think they're from by allegory so in here is all of my Huda Beauty lip strobes and liquid lipsticks this mirror right here is from impressions vanity I got this a few years ago. I think we should just go through these drawers now. So these are the Alex drawers from Ikea. I actually think I got this one off of Amazon. So in this first drawer, it's kind of miscellaneous stuff. There's some phone chargers, there's some eye masks that I got, some Q-tips, you know, nothing too exciting in there. So this second drawer up here, this is just some stuff that I have extras of. There's some foundations, primers, and concealers, color correctors over here. These containers right here, I got from Walmart. In here, we've got all of my Tattoo Junkie lipsticks and all of the effects that they come with. Lip scrubs, chapsticks, a bunch of ColourPop lipsticks, and then these are just kind of miscellaneous ones. I did a video with these chapsticks. I ordered them and they all came broken. And so they sent me replacement ones and they were all still broken. And so I gave up and I was like, whatever. But now I have a million of them and I never use them, so that's fun. So in this drawer, we've just got a bunch of lipsticks. I need to figure out if I'm going to start organizing them by like brand or how I'm gonna do that. So that's what's in there. Okay, as you can see, I have a ton of nudes, <laughs> raspberries, reds, and then I tried to do like corals and oranges. Um, so that's at least like, that drawer is kind of somewhat organized. Just need more space. I'm obviously like busting out of this drawer. In here is basically just like random stuff. There's some sprays, a bunch of silicone sponges, some brushes, um, some, some of these brushes in here, perfume samples. Why did, okay, listen, Ulta, Sephora, why do you give me so many of these? 
Like so many, that's a lot. I don't need that many, but thank you. Okay, what do we got in here? All of my ColourPop products fit in here. We've got a lot of um, like gel liners in here. So there's ones from Maybelline, those are from NYX, it's random like single shadows. The ones that I was showing you, like this one right here, they don't sell these anymore at Walmart. They discontinued these, but they still have these ones. And I paid like $10 for these. So not bad at all. And it fits things like this, which is awesome. Definitely recommend these if you have ColourPop shadows in these Alex drawers. So this is full of lashes. What do we got? We got Slay lashes. I love them. We got Huda Beauty. Love her lashes. Um, this is actually one of my favorite drugstore pairs. These are the Vegas Nade Grand Glamour ones and mine are dirty. Shh, shh, shh. I need to get rid of those. I obviously have more. Um, and this is the other brand that I really like the Eyler number 126 I wear these ones a lot so those are my favorite drugstore ones and then more high-end would be Slay Lashes and Huda Beauty are my favorites there and then this last drawer down here is just a bunch of palettes they've got Too Faced Chocolate Bar some BH these are some of the first palettes that I bought that I don't really use anymore but I keep them for like sentimental value that's what goes in there just palettes that I don't typically reach for on a day-to-day basis let's sit down and let's get into it okay so over here i like to keep some of my facial sprays we've got mario badescu the lavender and chamomile cucumber and aloe um i leave this farsali oil here because i mix that into my makeup a lot Ooh, hold on there we go just pretend you didn't see that these are just candle holders that i got from michael's and i keep my sponges in there i got this case off of amazon most of the acrylic cases that i have are from amazon but i tried to kind of organize my brushes by collection so this is a little case from bh cosmetics i keep some brushes in there these are from target and i keep more of my colorful brushes in here these are all my silk well almost all of my silicone brushes um for when i do face masks i keep those there these are my everyday face brushes that i use so i just keep all of those in there so i can just grab this whole thing and go especially like when i'm filming and then these are all of my fluffy blending eye brushes all of these little things that my makeup is sitting on those are all from hobby lobby i got them over in like the candle section so this is just the overflow of my brushes that i don't have anywhere else to put it we got some lip scrubs we got some serums we got my inglot duraline some lip balm mirror all right so over here i got this little by felicia sign that a friend gave me we got a bunch of maybelline lipsticks up here we got nyx nyx these are all just a bunch of random ones this acrylic case right here is from the original beauty box up here i keep all my balm cosmetics blushes here is basically just a bunch of like random stuff we have like lip glosses we have a few stila shadows like random liners it's just this is just random these are like my stick highlighters basically my stick and liquid highlighters in there we got more highlighters in here fenty beauty this last one is some powder highlighters that i couldn't fit in my drawers and then powder blushes i love becca cosmetics highlighters they're some of my favorite but there's makeup revolution back there milani blushes you cannot go wrong with those i absolutely love them okay so in this first drawer we have some of my most used eyeshadows all of these are makeup geek palettes um they're one of the first brands that i I started buying eyeshadows from and I was obviously obsessed so um, that's where I like to keep all those you know I'm always talking about Juvia's Place I love their palette so much so I'm always reaching for them they're just so colorful um, I think this is one oh you guys look how freaking pretty that is their packaging is so gorgeous the colors are even more amazing totally blendable love juvia's place i keep brush cleanser in here so that i can just spray it on my brushes and go second drawer is a bunch of my powder highlighters i love these mac hyper real glow highlighting palettes oh my gosh these are some of my makeup geek blushes and my ofra cosmetics highlight more makeup geek blushes makeup geek contour powders um we got my anastasia cream contour kits all my anastasia highlighter kits and then bh cosmetics kits right here okay so this kind of looks messy these are again drawers from walmart that i got for like ten dollars i keep all my foundations that i'm currently loving and using right there um this is just color correctors and co some concealers we got bobby pins we got like a mixing tray mirror things like that so this right here is kind of my tools area and my mascaras um so we just have like eyelash curlers scissors tweezers uh brow products dip brow and these are all of like my lip balms back here we have like liquid highlighters some hair products powders shadow shields things like that so these are all highlighters what do we got in here we got some milani highlighters we've got 
some Balm Cosmetics highlighters. I love these Maybelline ones. Those are amazing. These are all blushes in here. We got some bronzers and loose powders over here. Um, and then these are just some highlighter palettes. So, And then this last one over here is all of my eyeshadow palettes, some Huda Beauty. We have my Makeup Forever Flash palette. We've got NYX Cosmetics. We've got Thrive Cosmetics. We got BH Cosmetics, some Sigma. We got some Anastasia palettes. There's a BH Cosmetics palette down there. La Rock, uh, Shot Violet Boss, a bunch of Morphe palettes back there. Okay, so we were over there. Now we're over here. Starting up here is just a bunch more face palettes. These are all of my Huda Beauty highlighting palettes. We have some Benefit back there, some Violet Boss highlighter palette. I put newer like palettes that I get in here so that I can remember to use them and test them out. These are extra brow products in here. We've got eyeliners, mascaras, and then lip liners over here. Colored mascaras, my jumbo pencils, and like some cream shadows. And then all in here is like my liquid liner. So we've got glitter ones from Sephora. We've got NYX. We've got these new MAC ones. You guys, these do not come off. Liquid last. Yeah, they do for a very long time. This is another kind of random drawer. So there's a bunch of like my headbands that I use in videos back there. So this drawer has a lot of products that I still need to try out except for this area right here. So all of these back here, I still need to try. Yeah. Okay. Glitter. This is where I keep all of my glitter. I've got loose glitters in here. We have Makeup Geek Sparklers. We have this Stila Shadow. All of my Violet Boss glitters. I love their glitters. Um, my Glitter Tubes glitters. Oh my gosh, how pretty. This is like my favorite drawer to dip into. I'm always in here. And these are all of my Makeup Geek pigments. And these are just some colored gel liners. We have ColourPop, we have NYX. So this drawer right here is just a party. Okay, I keep all my uh, hair styling products, some brushes, dry shampoos, textured sprays. That is what my vanity looks like. That's what's in all of those drawers. Now, if you go over here, this is where I sit and film. I sit right there in front of that light and I do my little do, 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 do. That's what happens over there. So that's what you guys are seeing. Here's my camera. So you guys see from this angle right here, this is my little tripod that I do my live streams on. If you guys want like a more in depth of like what I used to film, let me know. But I just have this background light. This is what I see when I'm filming. So then my mirror sits on top of that and then there's the camera. There's my TV monitor so I can see what I'm doing and then it just connects to that right there. This is where the magic happens. In there is a storage room where I keep a bunch of my shoes and clothes in there. I'm not gonna show you that. That is my closet. It's a walk-in closet, but again, I'm not gonna show you that because it's dirty. Um, apparently your girl is still living in February. My gosh, why are all of my calendars? All of my calendars say February on them still. Here are all of my DVDs. You guys, I love collecting DVDs, but here's the weird thing is I don't like watching movies more than once usually. Isn't that weird? And then all of my workout DVDs. Over there, Jill and Michael, she's always kicking my butt. Here are my weights that I never use and workout equipment that again, pretty much never use even though I need to. <laughs> this is where I keep a bunch of my jewelry. I need to find a different way of storing my jewelry. So if you have any good ideas, let me know. So that is it y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I cannot wait to get my space together in Dallas and show you guys that. I am so excited that I can show this part of my life to you guys before I head off to Dallas. So I'm excited to take you guys on this journey with me. Anyways, this has been fun. I love you guys. Stay tuned for my next videos. We will speak soon. Say bye, Ray. Ray, can you say bye? Say bye to the friends. Bye, friends.